This is four minutes of Mari. Start the clock. Last year, I remember this, in one of the most memorable stories of the season, we met an 18-year-old woman named Madison who wanted to prove to a man named Jaquan that he was the father of her son, Elijah. Now, what made the story really so compelling to me was that Madison's own father, William, came on the show to give Jaquan a poignant lecture about being a good, responsible dad. After some deep reflection, Madison now believes a man named Cameron is baby Elijah's dad. So when did you realize that Cameron might be a possibility? One of his friends sent me a picture of his son and said that my son looked like his son. Did you tell him that Elijah could be his by then or not? No, because we, somebody sent me the pictures after we reconnected. He doesn't believe that, they, that my son is his. You should have told me I was possible. We lost contact, so how do you want me to tell you if we lost contact? Like I said, I tried to contact you on Facebook to let you know what was going on. Okay, well, obviously I never got that message, so I don't know what to tell you, Cameron. Did Elijah and Cameron ever meet? Yeah, they have met. He sees them every day. Really? So he's gotten into his he life. Is. He is. He's in his life, yeah. Even before he knows whether he's the father? Yeah, he's in his life right now. Your father, Madison, spoke to my producers, and he gave us this statement. He said, Madison, what are you doing? Why would you do this again? You are probably going to find out Cameron's not the father and looks stupid again. So if I look stupid, then I look stupid, and it's none of his business. I think that my dad should mind his own business because I'm grown, and if that's what happens, then that's what happens, and it's none of okay, his business. Okay, we have the result. In the case of one-year-old Elijah Cameron, you are not the father. Now, this lovely woman behind me is 25-year-old Shay. And Shay is coming to us from Atlanta, Georgia. Now, a few days ago, Shay found out a man named Kilo could be her biological father. A few days ago. Let's go back, because everybody ought to understand about you and LaShonda and how this all happened. And it happened way back in high school, right? Yeah, she was like my childhood girlfriend. And then you kind of, I guess, you kind of split apart and she went on in a different crowd and, and she got pregnant when she was young, did she ever tell you that, that she was pregnant? No, she never told me that she was pregnant. So you didn't know she had a baby? No, sir, I did not know she had a child. I won't say to be able to, to have a closure in her life to know that she have a father out here that really to be able to take care of her. I've had a lot of stories about people your age coming on to find out if a certain person was their father. But not one of these grown children have ever been able to block out the fact that they didn't have a father the way you have. Actually, it's hard, but I try to be nonchalant about the situation because growing up, I didn't have a father. This is okay. It's okay. It's good that you are emotional yeah, about so this. So it's unfair to me. Yeah, and I think maybe we should go. 25-year-old Shay, Kilo. You are not the father. Shay, are you okay? Yes. You okay? I'm fine. I'm here, Shay. I'm here. I'm right Thank here. Thank you, Kilo. I'm right here. It hurt me. It hurt me. It hurt me real bad. But I'm still here. You don't have to worry like that no more. Kilo, thank you very much. You're a stand-up guy. And that was Four Minutes of Mari. You are not the father. <laughs>